everyone, I'm Rincy and this is Rincy Reads. Today I'm going to be doing a book review on Incendiary by Chris Cleave. This book takes place in London and it follows a woman whose husband and son are killed in a terrorist attack that is done by Osama bin Laden. This book follows just her life in dealing with that situation, but it also sort of gives a glimpse into how a city would react in this situation and just how other people around her are dealing with the situation of having a terrorist attack happen in your town. This book is written in kind of like a letter format. She is writing a letter to Osama bin Laden talking about her life and talking about how she viewed that day and how she's dealing with every day afterwards. I have sort of conflicted feelings on this book. First off, the writing style took a little bit to get used to. Something about the way that it's written to Osama bin Laden kind of threw me off a little bit. This book reads just like any other letter, but you see her address Osama by just his first name, like, so you see Osama. That style, like, took me out of the story a little bit. Every time I would see that, I think seeing that name in this book would always jar me because it is such a potent name. Also, this book was not at all what I thought it was going to be, which is both a good thing and a bad thing. You never really want a book to be totally expected, but this book definitely threw me for a loop. If you are someone who needs likable and sympathetic characters in your books and stories in order to enjoy them, do not read this book because I don't think there's any character in here that's really likable or sympathetic. You could make the argument that you feel sympathetic towards the main character character because I feel like I did even though she is pretty not great but the fact that she has had her husband and son die in this terrorist attack and there's no one else in her family you know she doesn't have any other kids so it's just her by herself and her having to deal with that situation you could tell takes a toll on her so in that way you're sympathetic towards her but the choices she makes and the things that are done in this book are so difficult to deal with. You can tell that she's dealing with some sort of PTSD situation where this event is taking a very strong toll on her emotional and mental state but at the same time it is hard to just use that as an excuse for everything that she does in this book. There is this post that I saw on The Guardian last week that was called I Don't Like Strong Women Characters that was floating around. I'll have a link to that down in the description. But the idea behind this article was that this woman felt like she was sick of strong female characters, like physically strong, like women who are just kicking butt and there's nothing else really to them. She wants female characters who fall within every range that you can think of. She wants physically weak female character. She wants women who are dealing with issues and problems and women who are happy and women who are sad. She mentions how there are a multitude of different male characters. You have the heroes and the anti-heroes and she wants that for women characters as well. And I read that while I was reading this book and I felt like it made me appreciate this book a little bit more than I did before I read that article because the main character in this book and also the other female characters in this book are horrible and I hated them but then I appreciated this book for bringing up characters that are horrible and characters to hate because I feel like it's necessary for more than just the happy female lovable characters to be told like the stories of angry and dysfunctional female characters need to be told as well. In the end I gave Incendiary 3 out of 5 stars. I don't know if I would recommend this book for people. I feel like it depends on the person and what they're looking for. Like I feel like this is a really interesting story that I don't regret reading whatsoever, but at the same time, if you're someone who wants something very specific out of their stories, this might not be the book for you. But I enjoy this book because it pushes the boundaries and it's not something I feel like I've heard or read before. Those are my overly complicated and complex thoughts on this book. If you've read Incendiary by Chris Klee, feel free to leave your comments down below letting me know what you guys thought of it. I was looking up reviews on Goodreads to see how other people reacted to it and it seems like people either loved this book or hated this book, which I completely understand. I can totally see why people would love this book and I totally see why people would hate this book. And I feel like I'm sort of in the middle of that. Like I have both of those feelings in my head. So feel free to let me know how you guys felt about this book down below. So yeah, that's all I have for now and thanks for watching.